staying with the with the the theme here of nutrition, uh, this was somebody who wrote: Is there a preferred uh, seafood you would recommend, and is there any seafood you would avoid? I love all types, but fish versus crust crustaceans versus shellfish, there has to be some differences. So Natalie, I'll start that question with you. Do you have any thoughts around seafood and what we recommend with MetPro? Wild caught over farmed would be like the number one whenever possible. Um, there is, I was just trying to remember the name of it. Um, there's a, I think it's the Monterey Bay Aquarium has a fish kind of advisory little uh handout PDF that you can see where it shows kind of like the safest, um, in terms of like toxins within them. Um, uh, but yeah, um, wild caught when possible. And I mean, that's kind of the number one is like quality, I would say, you know, versus like those bottom feeders, like catfish, like people eat in the South, not worth eating, especially fried. Um, versus like wild caught, you know, salmon, trout, things like that. Um, uh, most people don't eat like sardines or, you know, those sorts of things. I think most of the time when people eat fatty fish, it's like a salmon, but um, there are other options that, you know, if you're wondering about, you can always ask your coach, like, does this count towards a fatty fish or a, you know, a lean protein? Um, and we can definitely, you know, let you know. Thank you. Dr. Singh, in your research, any particular thoughts about the fish, crustacean, shellfish, such? Not so much. I mean, it typically does go, um, at least the research shows, and we think about the Mediterranean diet, for instance, you know, fatty fish are going to probably be the best with respect to getting your omegas um, and for cardiovascular disease reduction. Um, but in terms of quality of fish, I think, you know, I would echo what Natalie says, just really looking at the source um, and being mindful of, of you know, the toxin level, that's going to be super important. But we, we have not, at least from uh, what I know, there's really no breakdown with respect to, you know, cardiovascular disease burden for fish versus shellfish or, or, or whatnot. <laughs>